Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Yvonne Lujano, and I, I work for the DOEJ. I'm the ambassador for Latin America. Um, well, I will present some slides quickly in case you don't know much about the, about the DOEJ. These are our new flyers, and I want to uh, please pay attention in the number two and four of our main uh, objectives or uh, aims in, 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 in DOEJ. Uh, as you, as you know, uh, one of the uh, main uh, uh, purposes of the OEJ is to make journals more visible in the, in the open access publishing landscape. Uh, these are some numbers and these are uh, some data that is uh, important to, to some of you if you are editors or librarians. Uh, and then I will, I will present, I will read to you some words about the the work I've done in, in Latin America since the Ambassadors Project uh, that uh, have been done since the last year. Uh, well, the OEJ is definitely much more than a global list of peer-reviewed open access journals in all subjects and languages. The OEJ provides services including reviewing applications which are free of charge. The aim of, re of the reviewing process is not primarily exclude, but rather facilitate and assist the journal's work uh, to come into the flow because we are skeptical about blacklisting or judging publishers work or journals in terms of their position in the international databases. We actually in the OEJ do not believe it is useful to state that some journals are, are mediocre because they are not included in those databases and I say that because some stakeholders in, in Latin America say that. So we um, we actually in the OEJ support the development of local publishing channels respecting different publishing cultures and traditions, but at the same time we support the idea that research results should be visible and discoverable in, on a global scale. Thus, we provide feedback to the publishers in terms of what are the best standards, transparency and best practice in publishing in the dig digital age. DOEJ is aware of the issues that editorial te teams face in different contexts, especially in those where journal uh, support is not based in a commercial model, which is the case of Latin America. Through my own experience working with the publishers of the region, I have realized that one of the main problems are related to the labor conditions of publishers and their teams, not only in terms of salary or rights, but also in terms of training and technological resources needed to increase quality of publications. Since in Latin America most of the journals are published by academic institutions, the OEJ is committed to join the existing collaboration no networks and create new strategies to share some recommendations to help publishers to do a better job in making their journals attractive channels for their users, which we think is the main purpose of journals. Uh, these users could be readers, authors, reviewers, etc. We have participated with some publishers collaboration, collaboration initiatives leading workshops and give a presentation in Argentina, Chile, Colombia, Cuba, Mexico, Peru and Uruguay besides the webinar series on transparency and best practice developed last, last year where 11 specialists from five countries presented trends and recommendations on topics on open access publishing, so, such as copyright, peer reviewed, op archiving, open science, etc. One of the main topics was the best practice using OJS as a platform of publication and editorial management. This topic is potentially useful for the publishers in Latin America since more than 90% of the journals from this region in indexed in the OJ use OJS. Uh, one of the challenges still pending here um, is to promote publishers, customize the platform and adapt it to their own needs and policies um, to, in order to make it uh, uh, their own platform. Finally, DOEJ has strongly collaborated with Cielo and Redalic. These initiatives help journals to upload content to DOEJ, which is another free of cost service the directory provides to increase visibility. And also is planning to, pr to work closely with Latindex, that is uh, another directory in, in Latin America. And finally, I would like to show you our social media, so please follow us. Thank you.